Okay, here is another way to make our presentations prettier and more interesting. Well, last time we talked about how to put things right in the middle. So I'm gonna push down my trackpad and drag the mouse to hold on to everything because I wanna do it all at once. What do we do? We come up here, we go to align, and again, I can just hover and it says center. Ah, everything is in the center, but again, it's too bright. I can go with the old color, this beautiful purple over here, but I also like to have diversity. So I'm gonna right click, uh oh, that little box got selected. I don't wanna do that, I wanna be outside of that little box. So again, control click or two finger click, there it is, change background. Change background. Let's go with some pretty green. Hmm. That's almost too bright. I'm going to try again. I go right, uh, two finger click or control plus click. And you can play around with this a little bit. Ooh, ooh, I like that. But oh my gosh, the, 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 the text went away. What do I do? Well, again, click and drag, select everything, and I want to change the color of the text. Let's see, the last time it was lime green. Let's see what orange looks like. Ooh, I don't like that. So I go back up to the text, and I pick yellow. Eh, yeah, that works. Okay. Now, what is my superpower? My superpower is resolving problems. You know, I'm best at resolving problems, especially that are puzzles, which might be one of the coolest words in Spanish, rompecabezas. Well, first thing I notice is there's not a period. We want people to take us very seriously. And when we miss a period, they focus on that and not on the message we're trying to send. So I'm gonna fix that first. Okay, I don't know what pictures, but wait, it's right there, rompecabezas, puzzles. So what can I do? Oh, I have to go and open up another tab, blah, blah, blah. Wait, hold on. I have a shortcut. Don't tell anyone. Okay, tell everyone. I go to insert up here. And I pick image. And some of your teachers don't know how to do this. Upload from the computer is if you already have pictures on the computer. And most of us don't. So I'm going to search the web instead. Now, let's see if it will find things in Spanish for us. Hmm, it might work. I hit enter. Oh, there's all sorts of little puzzles. I like them. Ooh, and this second one goes really well with the colors here. But I always like to have a bunch of choices, so I'm gonna look a little bit further. Well, I like that color because it kinda goes with it, but it's not, doesn't make me feel as good. Hmm, no, well, oh, that one's good, but it's not as colorful. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna go with this because I really like the colors and how they go here. I, again, I put either, I can either click it, see that little blue that comes up? And I can go to down here to insert or I can just click it with the trackpad and move it over. Uh oh, way too big. Can't even see the text anymore. I'm sure you guys already know. You click up here and you bring it down to size. Oh, I like solving puzzles. But you know, I missed some. Oh, remember, I move it around. See that little red dot? Oh, it's right in the center. I don't even have to do anything. Oh, I'm done, right? Well, maybe. Notice that there's a little, oops. Notice that there's a little bit less space between 
these words and the puzzle and the bottom of the puzzle and the bottom of the screen. So I'm going to try to get it just aligned. Ooh, I like that. But remember, let's go back over here to the pictures. Huh. I liked the one holding hands. So I wonder, let's do manos. Well, the one on the top is very funny. Um, well, it might work. Hmm. I have to make a decision. If I'm too funny, then people don't focus on my message. I want it to be funny, but I also want people to listen to me and to take me and my family seriously. So <sighs> I have to hold on to my emotions, no matter how much I think this one is funny. Can't quite do it. I did like the hands fixing things. Now I look at these hands, they don't look a lot like mine. They don't look like my dad's or my mama's. Mm, maybe not that one. Okay. I move down here. Okay. Ooh, I don't like the way this one makes me feel. Something just feels wrong about that one. Uh, I like the way that looks, but I can solve prop. Ooh, this one reminds me of my grandma, mi abuela. Look, older hands, friendship bracelets. I like that. That's solving problems and puzzles. But instead of like physical puzzles, they're the puzzles of the human heart. I like that one. So I click it. You see the blue thing come up and hit insert. And it's way too big again. Let's shrink it down to size. Come up here, click, and drag. But I want it to be in the middle again. Well, I really don't feel comfortable finding that little red line, so what do I have to do? I go to Arrange and Center on the page. Horizontally, but that doesn't look quite right, does it? So I come up here. Now, I can just guess at putting these two pictures together. Ooh, that's kind of hard. But what if I can make sure this picture is exactly in line with that picture? Well, here's how you do that. So I select this picture first, and then I put my mouse on top of this one. And I hit Control, click. Whoops. Didn't do the right thing, so let me try that again. I love making mistakes. I learn every time. I select the back one, okay, and then I hit shift on my keypad when I hit this one. Whoops, that didn't work either. Well, hmm, what can I do? Well, maybe I'll select all this. But, oh, I, well, I don't want the top part to be connected, do I? So that's not gonna work. I have to find some other solution. What if, cause this box is way bigger than we need. What if I made the box smaller? Now I can click and drag and select both of these at the same time. Ha <laughs> ha, yay, they're both selected. I go to arrange, and this is a little bit of a pain but it's okay. I go to align, center horizontally. Oop, looks like I nailed that one. And I go to arrange again, and then align middle. Ooh, I was so close. I like that. It's showing that I'm good at solving problems between people and real puzzles. That will show the world how smart I am because I have good punctuation, I have beautiful colors, I'm kind of making a joke, but I'm also making a point of solving puzzle of the human heart and real puzzles and how they're all kind of connected, just like all of us.